Hello everyone. I got a, an exciting video today. Oh, I think it's exciting anyhow. It's about inverters. And if you're not familiar with them, they're fantastic. And I, I think they're so very relevant at this moment in time. I, I want everybody to at least consider getting one. Um, I consider them as important as stored water and food in your pantry. Uh, they come in different sizes. This is a 410 watt inverter. And what an inverter does is it simply changes battery power into household power. It allows you to run your, your household items on it. And the reason why it's such a low number here, they make these very large and that, you know, they could run a microwave. But you don't want anything like that because it'll deplete your, your battery very quickly. Let me just go over it real quick with you and then, then we'll get into the details. Uh, first off, you want to get an inverter that has uh, fuses on the back that can easily be pulled out and, and replaced. Some are soldered into a board in, in the machine and you don't want one of those. This one comes with two outlets and a USB port. The USB port is fantastic because you can stick your uh, battery charger on it and have the car battery or marine battery recharge your cell phone. So if the power goes out, you have lights, not candles or lanterns. You have your cell phone charged so you can get on the internet or you can call loved ones. Uh, they're, they're just fantastic to have and it, it's they can recharge uh, smaller batteries. These are AA Antelope. That's E-N-L-O-O-P, uh, AA and AAA, and you simply get yourself a small little charger like this, and it'll plug in on a small extension cord and recharge your flashlights, your headlamps. And what's nice about this, I've gone over this before in an older uh, video in the archives. I'm just kind of modernizing it because I think it's real relevant right now for everyone. I show you how to make these little blocks and what's super nice about these flashlights is you can use them just as candles and they'll bounce off the ceiling and illuminate the whole room. The next day just recharge the batteries and you're good again for the next night. Uh, using a smart charger what a smart charger is, is a battery charger that will charge a depleted battery, but once it's, it recognizes that the battery is fully charged, it'll then go into a trickle mode, which means it'll just top off the battery for you. Uh, so if you have a rolling brownout, or blackout, but a rolling brownout, that means uh, it's on and off, on and off, uh, you just leave this plugged into the wall, connected to your battery and when the power comes back on it automatically starts charging it again and you don't have to be there when it happens. Let me show you if you're not familiar again with an inverter why it's so powerful. It simply has two clamps. The red goes to the positive, the black goes to the negative and then just like an outlet in your house you plug it in and you want to use special bulbs for this you want to, for example this is a fluorescent bulb that's only nine, 9 watts okay but it's equivalent to 40 a 40 watt bulb i think i read somewhere very very low energy consumption very high output uh, the LED lights are even better now. So, you just turn your inverter on, your little green light comes on, and instead of having, uh, again, candles throughout a house or um, lanterns, you're using your lamps that are in the house. It's a fantastic system. It's a great addition to a, a prepping, like I said, stored water, stored food and a battery with an inverter you're good to go. 
I did want to touch upon one other thing. A solar panel is nothing more than a battery charger. So if you got yourself a, a solar panel and a controller, that's, that's literally the guts of the, the battery charger, that would charge the battery. Okay? And then an inverter, just like this, and your so, the, the sun is then recharging your, your battery. For an emergency use though, I would have a backup generator like I have over here, but I would not waste gas uh, just carelessly. I would only use it possibly to charge my battery, but more importantly probably to run an appliance such as the uh, washing machine so everybody would stay and have clean clothes. Uh, well, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope this helps you. These little inverters are very inexpensive. You can get them at Walmart, Home Depot, Lowe's. This one in particular is probably around uh, $25, I'd say. I'll catch you on the next one.